Uh, hey guys, this is a comic I got today, The Witches of Island McGee. It is based on a true story and also a book by this guy, Possessed by the Devil, The Real History of Island McGee Witches. And it's also a work of fiction, obviously. So I just actually live near Island McGee, so it's very close to home and the sort of witchcraft there is something that was part of the history it's been very much overlooked and probably covered up and it would probably be one of the better reasons to visit there but it's all been pretty much neglected up until now but this is a signed copy of this book it's sort of similar to that film but which I won't really spoil it too much but there's the art here so it's definitely something you should probably check out. I don't know if you can probably get outside of Northern Ireland, but I've got it in the Bin Planet and also this poster and some goodies. So that's that. That's been a lot of crap about witches and TV and movies. There's been Hocus Pocus, which is pretty dull, won't even go into that. And also there's been this, The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina, which I didn't like personally, but some people might have enjoyed it, and even American Horror Story Coven, which kind of enjoyed, but I heard sort of witches say that it made them look bad, which is a bit funny. I've also seen people actually sued the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. Well, actually, the Church of Satan sued it, which is kind of funny. Christians aren't offended by it for some reason, but the Satanists are, which is really mad. So I used to live on up there, which isn't really on the map, but I used to live just a tiny bit above that. And even going up, I heard all these stories about witches and things, and stories about a field that nobody used because of the banshees, which is, I know it sounds a bit far-fetched, it sounds like it's just made up to stop people going near places, but I don't kind of think there might be some truth in it. And as for this, about the actual witches, people didn't just accuse people of being witches because they didn't like them. They actually did believe they did have supernatural powers, which is a lot darker than that movie, The Crucible. So, this is something I definitely would recommend if you can get your hands on it. I was looking up to get a signed copy. Okay, thanks for watching. Now, bye.